Greetings everybody, Okanye Games Online. Welcome back to more Persona 5. Last time. We escaped from Madarame Palace, but we didn't get out with absolutely nothing because we have a new team member, Yusuke. And in this episode, hey. let's go to bed. Saturday. All right then. Hey. Are you able to grab a seat. So we do have the alluring dancer. Let's finish that book. Hmm. Even when facing death, her soul was free. Wow. Yeah, this is stuff we saw however long ago when we read the first part of it. Oh. We finished the alluring dancer. The great beauty Carmen lived for love and passion. I suppose life without freedom is pointless. Well, I don't know if I could live exactly like she did, but you learned a lot, didn't you? Hmm. Nice three points to our charm. All right. Almost at the station. All right. Well, when we have time, we're definitely going to swap out that book for something else. Today we're going over. It's possible to apply math even to an abstract con concept like beauty. The golden ratio used in the Mona Lisa and the uh, Parthenium. Parthenium is a famous example. But a different ratio has been used in Japanese art and architecture since ancient times. Do you know what it is? Now then, Kusuru san, take a look at this. Give me an answer. What is the name of this ratio that Japanese architects and artists like have liked using? That would be the silver ratio. This is it. Precisely. Correct. You can see it's closer to a square than the golden ratio, right? One theory says it, it's because Asians have rounder faces than Westerners, so they prefer a similar shape. Ratio was used in things like ukiyo-e paintings and the pagodas at Horyuji Temple. One you should all be familiar with is the B4 sized paper. Those proportions are the silver ratio. No way. Wow, really? We know a lot. Nice, We're smart. Going. Probably still don't get a level up. No. All right. Jeez, you need a lot of knowledge. You have mascots that are seen as cute have faces that are close to this ratio. In other words, if you use this ratio, you can make cute things. I see. It is true that mascots tend to have roundish faces. Huh? Why are you looking at me like that? All right. Is it after school? It is after school. Well then. All right then. What do we do for today? Well, first of all, since I've already stated this, let's go to the library. And check out ourselves a new book. Oh, got return it first. Now I like to borrow a book. And we have a new book, The Gallant Rogue. As you may expect, it tells the story of Gullimon. So now we got The Gallant Rogue, so we'll definitely have to read that later. And what are my personas looking like? I've still got, yeah, I've still got the persona I need because... Because, because, news is the messaging me. Nobody I need to know about. Alright. Let's head back to our classroom because I can be completely full of it and the person we're looking for could not be there. Cool. Alright. Where? There's people in Yongijia, Jaya, and Shibuya. 
great and all, but I want to assume the person we're looking for is going to be somewhere around here. I can feel it. It's just a question of where. You know, I might as well at least walk around. Maybe we'll find a place. In fact, I'm just going to cut to when we find the person we're looking for, because it could take a while. Ah, there you are, on Just the person I was looking for. Hey! Oh, Akira. What are you, th what are you thinking of doing today? Let's hang out. Oh, and for reference, uh, On's in the underground story and I believe Shibuya. So I found the treasure. We've got plenty of time. Um. Oh, yeah, so I started training. So you should totally help me out if you have the time. Yeah, I picked you persona, so let's hang out with On. Yes. Let's go. Hmm. The best way to get to Inokashira Park is by train, right? Ooh, we got a new hangout area. All right. Big open places like this are great. I think my training is going to go super good today. So remember how I said before that I want to strengthen my heart? Well, I came up with a way to do it. And how would that be? I had to think about that for a second. I think having a strong heart means you don't let anything get under your skin. So basically, I want you to say stuff to me, and I'll try not to get phased by it. What kind of stuff? <laughs> we already started. I won't let that hesitation shake me. I guess I should say something on. Um, you're an airhead. Yeah, 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 and. response was annoying. And, uh, can we stop yet? Well, at least you're having fun with it, I guess. Huh? Wait, is this how the game is supposed to go? Oh, well, on to round two. Yes! Bring it on. This won't help your heart. I feel like this won't make our persona stronger. You're right. Mm. Huh. Something's not right. Sorry! Oh, sorry. I just got an email from my agency. The next shoot is really far. Wait. What's this at the end? It's noticing to pay extra attention to the time and place they tell you. Apparently, some models haven't been showing up at all lately. Then, when asked why they didn't come, the models all say they heard there was a change in the schedule. It sounds like shoots have been real hectic with all the scrambling they've had to do for substitutes. Uh, has this happened to you? Yeah! No, I haven't missed a single shoot so far. It probably really confuses the staff to see a sub showing up too. Hopefully it doesn't happen to me. Though actually, my first modeling gig was as a sub. That was back when I was still in Finland. My parents didn't have enough models for the event. Oh, have a nice one, you? Um. My parents are both fashion designers who put on some seriously extra extravagant shows. They jump from country to country, so I only really see them for half of the year. Maybe less these days. Uh, freedoms does sound nice. Yeah, I guess I can afford to be pretty lax these days. Plus, it would probably be tough being a phantom thief with my parents around, don't you think? It was rough when I was little, though. It was just me and our live and our live and caretaker. I didn't really have any friends. Well, that got dark fast. <laughs> 
Yeah. Honestly, when I'm modeling, it almost feels like I'm connecting with my parents somehow. It's a nice hobby to have, but I don't think I'd want to make a living out of it. After all, that's where Kamashita first spotted me. That's how our class started those rumors. Besides, the Phantom Thieves are more important to me right now. Nobody can be my substitute there. Yes! That's why I need to get stronger. Since that heightened motivation. And now we are ranked three of the Lover's Arcana. Because that, On is capable of performing a follow-up, which... While I was doing grinding, Ryuji was able to pull off a, uh, a few follow-ups, which unfortunately right. I didn't see, but... It was nice that it happened. Oh, yeah! I was little, I used to watch this anime where the main villain was the, this female thief. She loses to the hero every time, but I always thought she was cool. She wasn't really a good person, per se. She was beautiful, strong, sincere, and even sexy. She always said whatever she wanted, did whatever she wanted. She knew what justice was for her. I wanted to grow up to be just like her someday. <laughs> I hope I'm getting closer now. If only just a little bit. Bye! We'll see you later. See ya on. Ah, you're back. Back home. Ah, uh, come to think of it. Uh, let me check something. Yeah, we don't have a Hyrule fan persona. So we're gonna have to go grab one. But first... We gotta water our plants. Oh! Give us some bio-nutrients. Oh! Give me a few more points. Oh! Alright, now, really quick, let's swing by Shibuya and head to the Velvet Room. And we're here. Igor. Oh. Well, first. You'd like to read the compendium? You want to register it? Are you register sure? Register Jack Frost, just in case we fuse read it away here. later. And where are our Hyrule personas? Barrett. This a fee Thankfully, we got all the money this we could ever power. want at the moment. Done course, that's already. Not, that's not going to be lasting forever, but. It is time, inmate. Let's head back. And head back to LeBlanc. Because we are going to spend our time with a good old Sojiro. Hi, Sojiro. You got time right now? Our farm won't deepen just yet, though. Let's help him out. All right, then. Guides persuasive, and we get more points towards him. Though our bond will not deepen just yet, unfortunately. Thanks. There have been so many strange incidents recently. Well, I heard about this exhibition. Wasn't there a commercial for it? Hey, where are you headed, miss? Wanna chat for a bit? I hear people love him overseas, too. He is so popular. I know. About a good part-time job. Are you interested? Sunday. Alright, then. Let's... Do I have the persona that I need? Yeah, I do. Okay. So, first step. Not that. It's Sunday. You know what day that means. You you know what day that means. My, my English is English to the max. Alright. Let's head to the underground walkway because it's juice day once again. Buy yourself a juice. Hi. 
Stronger, the stranger people act like that perverted high school teacher. Oh yeah, we have seen this dialogue before. Let's do a clinical trial. In that case, my little guinea pig. There's something I want to test out today. Well, let's hang out with her. Please head to the exam room. <sighs> okay, that's all for today. Feeling okay, you can go home now. Hello? Dr. Takemi's Clinic of Internal Medicine. What? Again? That's well, that ship's already sailed, so. <sighs> what a pain. You remember that girl from the other day? The Chief of Staff Aoyamaya's patient? Your dad's been bringing her here to be treated, even though I referred them to another hospital. I even told them about the medical error I made. They trust you. Just a quack, though. Hmm. Medical error was well documented. Everyone in my field knows about it. I led the development of a new drug for an incurable illness. Ill illness. Illness. Illness called Crawford Endes Disease. Although I wasn't the only one who administered... Yeah, administered. I had to make sure it was administered, not administrated. Got, gotta be precise. The medicine. It was the cause of the error. With Crawford Endes, certain cells indiscriminately attack other cells throughout the body. When it reaches the muscles, the patient slowly begins to die. There hasn't been much progress made on it, partly because there haven't been many cases of it. I worked with a fair medic me pharmaceutical. Why? It's just because it, the word looks weird, I guess, that I couldn't recognize it immediately. The fair. Immediately after I say it. F pharmaceutical company. That I reached the final stage of production, but one day I was suddenly removed from my position. That chief of staff Oyamada, my superior at the time, took over the entire operation. <laughs> I don't know if he wanted the glory of developing a new drug or to become rich and famous, but he made careless mistakes and rushed to completion so he could use it on a patient named Miwa. Miwa-chan had a reaction and lapsed into critical condition. The chief panicked and laid the blame on me. Miwa-chan and her family resented me. No matter what I said, I couldn't change how they felt a bit, uh, about me. I had no idea. That's fine, I guess. Well, that doesn't matter. The development of the medicine was suspended. So I had no reason to stay at that hospital. At least now I can keep working as a general practitioner on my own terms with my guinea pig. That's the new medicine I've been trying out on you. This version is the final stage of testing. It searches for those cells that take the offensive and destroys them upon detection. That's why it's harmless for people who don't have the disease. Probably. That's good. <laughs> you have a lot of faith in me. Thank you, my little guinea pig. Hey. You better not flake on me this late in the game. I'm inching closer to the finish line, but I need your help to reach it. In exchange, I can offer you mess at a special price. I'm counting on you, guinea pig. Our bond's growing deeper and deeper. Now rank 5 of the Death Arcana. 
And we have immunization. Add support items to your inventory. All right. Hmm. Now, what should I do about that girl and her dad? Being mean and scaring them hasn't worked. It's been a while since I've had to deal with this kind of nuisance. It's stressing me out. Oh, sorry. That's all I wanted to talk to you about. You can go home now. Our brain increases our guts once again. All right. Bye. Okay, thanks for your hard work. Back at home. Ah, and we also back. still got well some free time. Home shopping programs airing? No, thank you. I think that is going to do it for this episode. Next time on Persona 5, we are gonna we're gonna continue hanging out with confidants, that's for sure, and seeing the, what else there is to see in their lives. See you guys then. Thank <laughs> you.